How's it going, guys? My name is TJP. Welcome back to another MLB The Show 24 video. We have our first. I put a player in the Zero League and they break the MLB. So I'm doing Babe Ruth. The reason I'm doing Babe Ruth is so I found a zero overall roster. However, all the zero overall rosters I've found only have legend players that are on those like mid century groundbreakers teams, the expansion era boomers, long wall beasts. So last year I was able to find a roster like that and it had some of the current players uh, replacing those legends. I don't have that this year. Uh, so either I have to A, wait for somebody to make it, or B, I will have to do it myself, potentially. Um, but the problem is, like, uh, it's a pain to make the roster every single time. Because you have to make it every single time, pretty much. Because if there's a player you suggest and I don't have it on my roster, then I'm pretty much screwed. So, that's tough. That's very, very tough. So, um... Yeah, for now, if you have any suggestions, legends only. Uh, leave a like, subscribe, enjoy the content, comment down below some of the videos over socials, play the second channel and main channel down below in the description if you like other content from me, TJP. With that being said, let's go on to the game. All right, so I've actually tried recording this before, too, and it, uh, it crashed when we got to the draft. So hopefully it doesn't do that. The game froze up, rather. It didn't really crash. So as you can see, we have Babe Ruth. He's going to be DHing as well as pitching, um, which is cool. And it is, in case you were wondering, all. And I used to be able to do this faster. It used to be all, uh, it's all zero overlogs or one overall players. So we're going to simulate right through. Uh, we'll see how well Babe can do. First game, 9-3 victory. Not too bad. Let's see when, they, when they're going to lose their first game. Okay, so they lost right there. Um... Hopefully the game doesn't freeze up again once we get to the draft. Um, I, w I really would prefer not to have to record this again, but I'm also curious to see if Babe Ruth will throw any perfect games. Probably not, but you never know. Uh, but I'm sure he'll win MVP, Cy Young, and all that fun stuff. I mean, it would be kind of weird if he didn't. Uh, I'm curious to see what numbers he'll put up, assuming he can actually get through. So this is where I kind of it froze last time. So we'll just kind of simulate it okay there we go yep yep all right we should be good now i can sim the season we should be fine with skip i'm just gonna go to the end of the season we're not gonna see the halfway stats kind of no point uh for this kind of video but yeah like i said i was trying to get through uh find a roster where it had current day players uh some of the current day players but unfortunately could not find one and i was trying to see if i could maybe Export a current player can't do that and the shows not allowed to do that uh, Basically any pretty much most of the league that has if they've had service time Any sort of service time you're not gonna be able to export them which kind of sucks I kind of wish they made it like it was like 2k where you could export any player you want Even if it's just local and I mean that would be perfect because then I could just Do that every time Ugh, but I can't so 154 uh, probably the best record in the league. Yep. League leaders, Babe Ruth, sh shot out, strikeouts 366, .47 ERA, win percentage, was undefeated, 31 wins, 24 shutouts, 25 complete games. So that's pretty good. 76 jacks, 65 doubles, 38 stolen bases, 268 RBIs, a batting average of 502. 291 hits, and he led in a whole bunch of other categories. Um, does that still do that thing? Where, yep, it does. Doesn't uh, max out to uh, 256. Yeah, he played all 162 games. Insane stats there. Uh, also, too, it's funny that they uh, they keep track of the total home runs. So now he is officially the home run leader. Again, 790. Coming back from the dead to do Babe Ruth things. So you love to see that. Of course, awards, we have a Cy Young, a Hank Aaron, an MVP, a batting title, and a triple crown. No surprises there. Shout out to this Joe Random. 17 home runs and 126 RBIs. It's pretty impressive. This Joe Random went 20 and 3. Wow. Impressive. So we already saw the stats. Uh... I mean, we should be able to win the World Series, but, you know, knowing this game, sometimes that doesn't always work out that way. So this should be an automatic win, 2-0 win. Did we throw a perfect game? I should probably check that. I don't think we did. I mean, I could look 
if I'm, you know, if I'm really that curious, but it has happened before where someone has one for a game. It's very rare, but it has happened. Um, but we're not going to check it. I, I thought about checking it, but like, nah, I don't want to go through every single game. It's not worth it. Uh, let's see. Game two, we win 17-5. Game three is a loss, but here we go. We're going to win this game. Baby, two to one. Let's go. Yeah, I just can't, he just can't get a loss when he pitches. You know, that's the, that's the thing. He's pitching again here. Minnesota, they win two to one. Game two is an 11-8 win. Game three is a 15-9 win. Game four is a sweep. So either the Braves and the Mets, Mets would be kind of cool. And we get the Mets. Let's go, a little Subway series. By the way, let me just take a look at the standings. Just so I'm curious. So Twins 88 wins the, look at that. Every single team, that's as close as you'll ever see a division race. <laughs> and all of them were under 500. I feel like there's not going to be that many. There wouldn't probably wouldn't be that many bad teams either. Like the worst team is the Padres. Because it's just so balanced. It's crazy. So we taking on, I forgot. Oh, the Mets, right. Mets, 86 win team. And who did we beat? I forgot who we beat. Oh, the White Sox. And the Twins. We already saw the Twins. Okay, game one, Babe Ruth. That's tough. That's tough. That is tough. Okay, got to win game two here. We don't. We're down 2-0. Okay, we might lose. We might lose. Oh, my God. We might we're, We might, We might. might get swept. Well, I don't think we're going to get swept, but we're not going to win. We're not going to win this. We got to win four straight. Okay. Babe Ruth wins that. Okay. If I go in, usually what happens is is the, the sim goes crazy. I should put Babe Ruth in the pitch. I'm not going to do it. We're just going to fast, fast sim it. We're just going to sim through it. Not just so that we don't cheat. Okay. Win game five. If game six. Game six. I'm, if they, we win that, I'm, I'm going to do game seven just so we watch celebration. And then we're basically guaranteed to win. So we have to win this game. Okay. Yeah, it's over. I mean, Babe Ruth would obviously, we'd probably still win this game anyway, but I'm going to hop on in. And we'll quick manage. Um, this should be fairly easy win um, for us. So we're just going to fast sim it and should be good. Yep, we're up 6-0. Babe Ruth is just going to pitch the entire distance and... Their Joe Randoms are doing their thing. Seven. Okay. Boom. Boom. All right. Let's hop on in and watch the final out. All right. Well, the improbable has happened. We have came back from a 3-0 deficit, and we're going to end up winning this because they're not going to win this. However, I would like to see how this works out. Babe Ruth, 127th pitch is a strike. He is gone. Crazy, look at him, man. What a legend. This dude is a legend. The wind up in the pitch. Fouls it off, and this could be it. Babe Ruth on 129 pitches for this guy. And it's a swing and a miss. And we came back from a 3 0 deficit. Babe Ruth definitely going to be. The MVP. I don't see why he wouldn't be, but we got the job done. <laughs> and they're the Joe Randoms. Uh, yeah. Also, one thing I found out too, and we're going to definitely do this, is you could have the women and the men on the same team. That is such a game changer for video, for like content ideas. That is such a game changer. I already have some ideas in the pipeline with that. I saw that. I was like, what? No way. So. That'll be something to behold as well when we get to that point. Uh, but we'll take a look at the postseason stats and close up the video. Um, but yeah, hopefully at some point I will be able to get current players uh, into this mix like I was at, we were able to do last season. Um, so yeah, World Series MVP and Playoff MVP, Babe Ruth. Obviously did super well. In case you guys want to see the lineups, there they are. Good stuff. Actually, we hit pretty well overall as a team. And, of course, the pitching was pretty insane. So, chat to the boys. All right. Let's close it out.
All right, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like, subscribe, comment down below some more videos, or socials play the second channel, the main channel, down below in the description if you like the content from me, DJP. With that being said, I'm going to head on out. Take care, see you soon, and peace.